Hey guys, it's cool I'm here today, 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 I am here today, and today we're going to be looking at some subtraction, okay, subtraction of big numbers, so we're going to do some long, long subtraction, shall I say, okay, so anyway, without further ado, let us start, I'm going to um, turn my page into three actually, I think today, oh, and my, it's doing a funky thing, it's doing a th a funky thing. Okay, so you can split it into three parts. So one and two. Okay, it's a pity that I can't do a straight line, but never mind. So let's have the number. We're going to do sixty-eight. Take away twelve, and we'll do uh, fifty-four. Take away. Uh, 32 and we'll do uh, 36 take away uh, 14 14 okay so let's do it so when take when you're doing takeaway the way how they've given you the question that is the way how you need to write it out okay so if they've put the 68 first take away the 12 that's what you need to write first so you put the 68 and the 12 underneath okay so let's begin so eight take away two that's going to give us six and six and take away one is going to give us five that's our answer 56 lovely piece of piece of pie i was about to say something else there but yeah i saved it piece of pie okay lovely so now we've got 54 take away 32 very very simple so four take away two is going to give us um two and five take away three is also going to give us two so we've got 22 there lovely now next we're going to have 36 take away 14 so 36 take away 14 so i've got six take away four is going to give us two and three take away one. Oh, what is it with these two two twos i don't know okay so that is um, subtraction with very, very easy one, shall I say? Very, very easy subtraction. Okay, lovely. Look at a few more examples. So, again, let me break my page into three one, a two, and a three. Oh, my days, what just happened there? Oh, oh for goodness sake, it's done it again, hasn't it? Uh, let's go with a little bit of a green actually. Might as well. Okay, so let's have the numbers. So this these are ones that are going to involve carry. <laughs> Sorry. Um yeah. So I have forty three take away uh let's have twenty five. <laughs> Okay, so we've got 43, take 25, lovely, so 3 take 5, no you can't really do that like that, it's going to give you a negative number, so we need to borrow, we, we are going to borrow, um, just a, a quick thing there, many of you, when you see this, when you see like a smaller number and you're taking away a bigger number from it, some of you will say, oh, well, that's going to give me a positive number. How is that going to give you a positive number? If you've got a small number and you're taking away a bigger number fr from it than itself, it's going to give you a negative number. Okay? But we don't want to be dealing with negative numbers here anyway. So we want to be dealing with positive numbers. So now we've got three take away five. So, some of you may say that's two. It's not two. Okay? You're going to have to do the hard work, which is you're going to have to borrow. Okay, I think some of you, some some people that I've seen in the past, you know, they just want to do things the easy way, and it's actually the wrong answer anyway. So anyway, we need to borrow, we need to borrow, and what we're going to borrow, we're going to borrow, because we need to make this three, we need, we need to make it a bigger number. So we're basically going to borrow one from this four. So this four is going to turn into a what? This four is going to turn into a three, and we're going to borrow one from it. Okay, so now we've actually got 13 take away five okay so 13 take away five 
is actually going to give us 8. Lovely. And here we've got 3, take away 2 is going to give us 1. So 43, the original question, 43 take away 25 is going to give us 18. We had to do a little bit of carryover, and I do not like this um, lime green, to be honest. I'm going to go back to my lovely yellow. I can get it. Oh, my days, what am I doing? Oh, for, oh my days, it's just... Oh, gosh. This thing with technology sometimes just really, really gets in nerves. Okay, so anyway, want to look at the question. Let's look at uh, 87 take away um, 49. Okay, so 87 take away 49. Lovely. Okay, so 7 take away 9, we can't really do that. So we're going to have to borrow 1 from this 8. So this 8 is going to turn into a 7. And put the 1 there. So we've got 17 take 9. 17 take 9 is going to give us 8. And we've got 7 take 4. We can do that easily. So that's going to give us 3. Beautiful. Let's look at another example. Let us have... Uh, Two, four, uh, three, take away 75. Okay, so we've got two, four, three, take away 75. Now, what are we going to have now? Oh, scary. Okay, first thing first is. 3 take 5, uh, no I can't do that, we need to borrow it, so we're going to borrow from this 4, so this 4 is now going to turn to a 3, and this is going to turn to a 13, 13 take 5 is going to give us 8, 3 take 7, no we can't do that, so we're going to have to borrow, we're going to have to borrow from this 2, so this 2 now, since we're going to borrow 1 from it, it becomes a 1, okay, uh, actually that may not, so this 2 now becomes a 1, and we've borrowed one from it, so that becomes a 13. So we've got 13 take away 7. 13 take away 7, guys, what's that going to give us? That's going to give us a 6. And 1 take away 0 is just going to give us 1. So our answer is 1, 6, 8. Make sense? Yep, no. Well, hopefully it does. So let's look at two more examples. Split the page into two then, since we're looking at two more examples. Yeah, bang. So now we're going to have, um, let us have um, six, four, two, take away, one, nine, five. And on this side, we're going to have, in the blue corner, comes five. Uh, three, six, take away, uh, four, nine, two. Okay, so let's go, let's do this. So we get six, four, two, take away one, nine, five. Do, 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 so 2 take 5, can't do that, we need to borrow 1, we're going to borrow 1 from the 4, so the 4 now turns into a 3, and that turns into a 12, so 12 take away 5 is going to give me 7, okay, now we've got 3 take away 9, we can't do that, so we need to borrow 1 from the 6, the 6 turns into a 5, and the 3 that was there now turns into a 13, 13 take away 9 is going to give us 4. Beautiful. Now we've got five take away one. That is going to give us a four. I don't know why that took me so long to think of actually. That was quite strange actually. Okay, lovely. So we're going to go over to the other side. Five, three, six, take away four, nine, a two. Let us do this. So we've got 6 take away 2, we can easily do that, so that turns into a 4. Uh, 3 take 9, we can't do that, we need to borrow 1 from this 5, so the 5 turns into a 4, 
and 3 turns into a 13, 13 take away 9 turns into a 4, and 4 take away 4 is equal to 0, so our answer is actually 44. Well guys, that is a little bit of subtraction for you, long subtraction, and I hope you understood that clearly. If you haven't, you can go back and look through the video again, and hopefully you will understand it a little bit better. Thank you for tuning into Paul Maths Labs, and I'll see you guys later. Bye-bye!